Alexander really just... He's a character. Ooh. It's a man, guys. It's a man! And he's moaning and groaning like he's having problems. Maybe he has bowel trouble. Oh, jeez! Holy crap! La tuba! <laughs> 7th of August, 1833. <sighs> there is no denying that Alexander puts a lot of faith into what I can only describe as magic. I'm not surprised. Even while traveling across Europe, I assumed I would have to embrace the supernatural to save my mind and life. As a novice, I do everything in my power to stay focused and not dwell too much on my own doubts. Alexander woke me up early and told me it was time we got started on our work. He was obviously excited to get going and we headed downstairs to the old dungeon where he preferred to attempt his rituals. Ooh. It turns out that Alexander is a true Renaissance man, paralleled only by Da Vinci, I'm sure. Interesting. He showed me several rooms fitted for specific research, such as anatomy studies, alchemy, and botany. The crown of botany Brandenburg must me. be the inner sanctum, a most hallowed ground where we shall attempt to permanently banish the orb's shadow. Botany scares me. There's this. Come on. Jeez. There we go. Oh, and the lights went out. The lights went out. Some of us sister here. Don't really care at this point. Gosh darn it. I'm so bad. And I hate water. Ah. Ah. What is happening? Oh no. Don't no. You have got to be kidding me. Oh shh. 